studio is called Once in a Blue Moon. I paint and I create and I play. I started uh, with art classes in the early 70s, University of Alberta distance classes here in Hinton. We had professors come from Edmonton, the drawing, composition, design, uh, various um, mediums like uh, watercolor, acrylic, and printmaking. I picked up my skills that way and uh, absolutely loved being an artist and I uh, wanted to pursue that as a career, but then Life intervened and I had to go to work and so I became a realtor for a couple of years and then went into travel. Fortunately for me, I was able to retire at the age of 50. I decided to go into art again and um, started uh, working in my own little studio at home. It seems like each year I'm trying something new and enjoying it very much. So I went from painting in watercolor, which was my very first uh, foray into art and uh, then on to uh, batik painting on uh, rice paper. Most recently I devised um, methods of doing very unique fused glass. There's a start and there's a middle and then there's a finish and I'm upstairs having breakfast and I, I'm just so eager to get down to my studio to start on what I have planned for that day. One of my favorite thoughts uh, when I'm creating is uh, that I think when a person looks at a piece that they're going to say to themselves, how did she do that? Quite often what I start out with and what I finish with is not always the same thing. I do um, a huge variety of different um, styles and um, I, but I do prefer uh, landscapes. We're right in the heart of uh, the, the lakes and the mountains and uh, the, the gorgeous scenery. Art, um, to me, is a therapeutic process and I, that's why I enjoy working with other people to help them feel good about themselves. It's good for me and it makes me feel happy. It, it brings me to in, inside myself and makes me feel happy and makes me want to make other people happy.